Well, I'm very excited about today's video as we're gonna discuss about Polygon or Matic. Before we proceed, a quick disclaimer. This video is designed for educational purposes. Please do your own research before investing as I'm not a financial advisor. Now, before that, some major news which are coming in for Polygon in the last few days. Uniswap version 3 contract deployments uh, are approved to be deployed on Polygon with 99.3% consensus. Now, that speaks volume about the adoption. Uh, Reddit co-founder and Polygon, they launched $200 million Web3.0 social media initiative. And last but not least, um, it's it's pretty much widely accepted that Polygon is a necessary gem in the in the crypto verse. Now, what is Polygon? Now, uh, let me share this analogy so that you will understand um, what is what is the utility or what's the advantages of using Polygon. Now, imagine that uh, there is a particular road uh, that's being built in. Now, you, you have been given a car where which can carry one single passenger, right? So, imagine the passenger is a data. So that data needs to be transferred from point A to point B. Implications, um, imagine the road has few bumps as well. Now, uh, one, low speed. And the most important part is high cost per transaction or high cost per transporting that passenger, which is data in this. Uh, now, that is where you need a proper track or, you know, take an example that a normal road, you need a highway or a bullet train. You need a, a faster turnaround for this data to transfer from point A to point B. You absolutely need high speed. You also need you need low cost per transaction. Now imagine that uh, if one particular data point needs to be transferred from point A to point B, you also have a second data point, third data point, they have the same path. Why can't you combine all the data points together and then transfer it to point B? Absolutely doing the validation be between or there should be an aggregator in between that is where ZK Rollup comes into picture. So that is what Polygon does. Now, as I mentioned before, that it's a layer two um, scalable solution for Ethereum. This is only for Ethereum. So if you're not a big fan of Ethereum, that may not attract you, but you, you need to understand that Ethereum is the only mover in smart chain uh, world and it is just behind Bitcoin. And Bitcoin is, is, is absolutely a um, people are comparing with cryptocurrencies and um, you know from a currency standpoint Ethereum is absolutely the platform of the layer one solution which a lot of um, institutional investors have invested on and working on the platform. The cap uh, for Polygon at this time is 12 billion dollar. People say that it's too high. There are a few people who say it's too low. Uh, but I'm, I'm uh, leaning more towards that it's slow it can absolutely reach to 50 billion dollars which is four times from now similar to token price 2.3 i absolutely expect that it will at least reach uh four to five dollars uh, at certain certain uh time now uh, a very high level snapshot now before uh, i show it to you first of all congratulations you are an investor in the decentralized world uh, which is extremely different so you're part of the revolution right there are people who are just being um you know holding back they want to see and it, and i personally feel it's going to be too late there will be of course a roller coaster but uh, if you are listening to this video if you have invested even a hundred dollars in these projects you are absolutely an early mover um, now what problem that polygon is solving so as you can see on the left side you have ethereum you have multiple um uh, multiple solutions and uh, the green the the purple ticks are where the polygon network really comes in which is really attaching a complete layer 2 solution on top of layer 1 which is ethereum on the right side polygon pos is live zk rollups is live optimistic rollups and validin chain is gonna come soon from an understanding standpoint um zk rollups and uh, sharding are the two main concepts now zk rollups which has been adopted by Polygon, why? Because you need an aggregator. So as I, as I uh, given in the previous example, you, you have a set of data points which need to be transferred from point A to point B. You need a particular validator in between before it get transferred to point B. That is where ZQ rollups comes into picture. Uh, sharding is, uh, is a different concept of layer two uh, tech. Pretty much uh, it's popular itself. Um, what it does is that uh, for one particular data point, it breaks into smaller pieces from a security standpoint. It gets distributed and it gets reassembled once it reaches point B. 
So these are the two main concepts, but again, from a polygon standpoint, you only need to know the roller. Now, in regards to uh, the major news again, uh, Polygon had got into a partnership with GameOn uh, Portal and a major leading firm, which is uh, Mir, a groundbreaking ZK startup in a 400 million deal um, a few days ago. Now, one thing which I always say to my friends, viewers, that Polygon is not a token, but it's the ecosystem. It has um, it has various components. Polygon POS, which is proof of stake, and one thing just to mention, proof of stake for Polygon is hybrid uh, version, which is combining sidechain and uh, layer two solution. We have Polygon uh, Hermes, as I mentioned uh, on the right side. You know, this is kind of a detailed plan, but a very high level concept of Hermes is again not going in detail, but just how can you have the smallest um, ZK, which is a zero knowledge proof uh, for validation. We have Pol Polygon Mitten. We have Polygon uh, software defined kit uh, for developers. Polygon Nightfall, this is the EY project. Um, and Polygon Avail, again, how can you have the high availability of the decentralized information uh, through Polygon Network? Last but not the least, uh, a quick note NG Motor India is launching their NFTs on Polygon in six days from now. So everybody's uh, really looking forward for the NFT. Well, if you like the video, please do subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon so that you get the notification for all the new videos that's going to come in uh, later. Thank you again uh, for watching this video. We'll see you again. Take care. Bye.